Hey everyone, Coach Chris here, and today we're going to talk about my favorite winter cross training activity, snowshoe running. If you haven't tried it, I definitely recommend giving it a whirl. It's low impact and it really doesn't require much skills. If you can run, if you can walk, you're golden. Besides being a heck of a lot more fun than running on the treadmill when it's cold outside, snowshoe running will also help strengthen your hip flexors, your calf muscles, your hamstrings, and other stabilizing muscles. When you go for a run with your snowshoes on, don't be discouraged by how fast or how slow you're going. Generally speaking, you're going to go three to five minutes per mile slower with your snowshoes on, for obvious reasons. Also, because of that, <clears throat> make sure you measure your workout in time and not in distance. Okay, so where to begin? Well, obviously you'll need some snow and some snowshoes. You can really use any pair of snowshoes, but I recommend using some run-specific snowshoes. These are often lighter, smaller, and sometimes they have a little spring to help you get running a little bit. Next, I recommend using a pair of poles. You don't have to, but they're going to provide you with a little bit of stability as you're moving through the snow. And it will also help you navigate up through uh, steeper terrain. When running with snowshoes, all you need to do is strap on a pair of running sneakers. Leave the boots at home. You're not going to need them. A couple tips and tricks to keep your feet warm and dry while running with snowshoes. Here we go. We got these cycling booties or shoe covers. These are made of neoprene and they will keep your foot dry and warm. Also, you got these gaiters. These gaiters will go over your foot and help prevent snow from going down your sneakers. I would definitely recommend a pair of gaiters. Also, if you have trail shoes or Gore-Tex shoes <clears throat> that are waterproof, those are helpful and a bit of an upgrade from your regular running sneakers. That's it. Have fun and enjoy some snowshoe running. For more information on snowshoe running and the related article, you can go to RidgewoodTriathlete.com under the knowledge section.